So looking through some of the finer details in Alu Splash, is this L-shaped edging profile, how we trim a raw edge and how we get a return around the panel. So it's really simple how we're gonna now get around this corner. We simply take our L-shaped edging profile. This edge here is designed to cover any of the raw panels and this bit here is the adhesive peel you remove and then stick it onto the back of your panel. So all we've done with this L-shaped edging is cut ourselves a 45 degree angle and that's simply gonna roll into installing like so. Now before I peel the tape off, I want to check that the panel's gonna be, the join's gonna be good. So I'm just gonna check here that my mitres are good and it sits around the panel in a minimalistic detail as such. So now we can start applying it. So now we've cut our 90 degrees on our trims, we're ready to install it. So to install it, the easiest way I find is to push one piece up, ensuring that both pieces of tape are still on. Check your join, make sure that you're happy with where your mitre is going to sit and then leave one piece of trim in situ. Take and remove your tape off and I pull it about halfway and then fold it over. Now what that means is that I've got room to manoeuvre my trim without applying it. I then get to line up where my join sits and once I'm happy that that's going to be in position, I push down and apply that. Now I'm in a position to just simply remove the rest of my tape and stick my trim. Now I know that that piece is stuck exactly where I need it to be sat perfectly and minimalistic. Now I've got to come along and do this edge. So all I'm gonna do is the same process, ensuring that my 45 is good. Again, I always hold it up at an angle just to make sure that I can move the trim up and down, push it into position like so. And now we have the nice detail of the finished article.